Welcome back to Tech Mimic, where you can simply view, imitate, replicate, and get on with your day. If there is a specific issue for which you would like to see a video, please leave a comment. When you browse the internet, it now appears that almost every website is asking you to sign in with your Google account, even if you don't have one or you don't want to. Just a few examples are Reddit, The New York Times, TripAdvisor, Pinterest and eBay. Clicking it away only helps for a few seconds, it feels, because the next website or the next visit to the same website will just ask you again. A common method is to disable the prompt from within your Google account's permissions page, but that's not the solution of this video. Also, this will only work if you actually have a Google account. Maybe you don't want to change it, or you want a different method altogether. The solution I'm going to describe will work for Firefox and Chrome, independent of your operating system. In my case, I'm using it for Windows and various Linux distributions. I will demonstrate this step by step for Firefox first and Chrome second. As you can see in this example, a visit to the Reddit website results in the mandatory cookie requests, and almost immediately the sign in with Google prompt appears. Open the Firefox menu, click on the three lines, the so called hamburger menu, and select add ons and teams. In the search box, search for uBlock and hit enter. Click the top one named uBlock Origin and click Add to Firefox. uBlock Origin is a very popular content blocker, going beyond the capabilities of a regular ad blocker, as you will see in a moment. Click Add again and specify to also work in Firefox private windows. You don't need to do this, but just for demonstrating purposes, I've restarted Firefox, opened Reddit again, and the prompt is once again on the screen, because at this moment it is still not blocked. You can see that uBlock did something, because numbers are now appearing beside the small uBlock icon. Click the uBlock icon, and then the gear icon to open the settings. Click the My Filters tab, and insert the following line that is now on the screen. For your convenience, you can just copy and paste this straight from the description of this video. Click Apply Changes, and the pop-ups are now gone while you are serving the internet. The current filter is working well for me, but I have found during my research one more filter that appears to be working. This one is also in the video description, in case you are having issues with the first one. To do the same in the Chrome web browser. Click the icon of the three vertical dots, select Extensions, and visit Chrome Web Store. Search for uBlock and make sure to select uBlock Origin. It is the one with the highest amount of downloads and most likely it will be at the top of your list. But just make sure you select the correct one. Click Add to Chrome and click Add Extension. Click the extension or little puzzle piece icon. Select the three vertical dots beside uBlock Origin and select Manage Extension. Click Extension Options and click the My Filters tab. Insert the following line that you see on the screen now. For your convenience, you can copy paste this straight from the description of this video. Click Apply Changes and the pop-ups are now gone while you are serving the internet. The current filter is working well for me, but I have found during my research one more filter that appears to be working. This one is also in the video description, in case you are having issues with the first one. That's it, hope it helped, and if it did, please like the video and keep it up. Until next time, bye!